For this problem, we want to solve for x in the equation log base 25 of 3x squared minus 12 minus log base 25 of 2x minus 3 equals 1 half. We can use the quotient property to combine the logs. So we get log base 25 of 3x squared minus 12 over 2x minus 3 equals 1 half. To remove the log, we can use this next property. For this equation, b equals 25 and y equals 1 half. So the equation becomes 3x squared minus 12 over 2x minus 3 equals 25 to the half power. 25 to the half power equals the square root of 25. So we now have 3x squared minus 12 over 2x minus 3 equals 5. To remove the fraction, we're going to multiply both sides by 2x minus 3. This gets us 3x squared minus 12 equals 10x minus 15. To solve for x, we want the right side of the equation to be equal to 0. So we're going to subtract 10x minus 15 from both sides to get 3x squared minus 10x plus 3 equals 0. The left side can factor out to become 3x minus 1 times x minus 3 equals 0. Now we have the equations 3x minus 1 equals 0 or x minus 3 equals 0. For the first equation, we get x equals 1 third, and for the second equation, we get x equals 3. Now we want to check for extraneous solutions. If we plug in x equals 3, we get positive logs, so this works. If we plug in x equals 1 third, we get negative logs, so this is an extraneous solution. Therefore, x equals 3 is the final answer.